Client Setup. In this video, we are going to show you how to set up a new client in Drake Accounting. From the tree view on the left side of the screen, go to Client, Add, or click the Add a New Client button at the top of the Client Selector screen. The Contact Information tab is the first tab you see. Red validators indicate fields that must be completed before you save the client. The client code is a unique code consisting of up to 12 alphanumeric characters and cannot be changed once the client is saved. Enter a password to require a password to be entered every time the client is selected. Complete the rest of the client's contact information. The next tab is a business information tab. From the drop list, select either monthly or semi-weekly for the client's deposit frequency. If the client deposits semi-weekly, a Schedule B is produced with a 941. Assign the client's business type from the drop list. This information is used to present the appropriate forms and lines when setting up field mapping in the client's chart of accounts, which is used to export to Drake Tax. Choose whether the client uses cash or accrual accounting method. Select cash accounting method to record revenues and expenses when money changes hands. Select Accrual Accounting Method to record revenues when they are earned and expenses when they are billed. This should not be changed mid-year. For the start of year date, enter 1-1-2020 for a calendar year client or the date of the beginning of the client's fiscal year. If the client provides employer leave and disability plans, check the box next to Employer has Private Family Leave Insurance Plan and or Employer has Private Disability Plan and then enter the plan numbers. Create an unlimited number of divisions in the Divisions tab. Assign divisions to employees, vendors, accounts receivables customers, and journal entries to provide reporting clarity. To add a division, click the Add button. Type a division code. Division codes are alphanumeric and a maximum of 20 characters. Type a division title, which is anything that makes sense. To add more divisions, click the Add button or type Ctrl-N and repeat the process. To delete a division, highlight the division and click the Delete button. In the State tab, select the client's state from the left and enter applicable information under Selected State, including State ID, State Unemployment ID, and the State Tax Entity Code. Checking the Box 18 Local Wages Should Equal Box 5 Medicare Wages option makes Box 18 and Box 5 the same on Forms W-2. Under State File, select the eFile State checkbox to send state tax and wage forms electronically. Depending on the state selected, fields may appear that need to be completed. If this is a multi-state client, repeat this process for each state. Drake Documents is available to anyone who has Drake Tax and is installed during the Drake Tax installation process. If you do not have Drake Tax installed, the Drake Documents Options tab is not available. When used, Drake Documents is enabled in Drake Accounting, reports that generate as PDF files can be automatically or manually saved to the client's Drake Accounting folder within the Drake Documents structure. Select Drake Documents location by highlighting the location to store the client's information. The path displays in blue font. To choose a different location from the default location, check Override Client Destination Directory and then select the desired location from the Client Directory drop list. Last, select whether to save documents automatically, meaning files are automatically saved to your client's Drake Documents folder, or manually, which requires you to respond with yes or no before a file is written to the client's Drake Documents folder. Please note, to view the files in Drake Documents, you must use the Archive Cabinet, which can be enabled by opening Drake Documents under Setup, Options, and select Use Archive Cabinet. The last tab we are going to look at in this tutorial is the Notes tab. Click the bold, italics, and or underlined buttons on the right to customize the note. Type the note into the screen and check the Append Date Time box to timestamp the note. After you enter a note for a client, there is a Note button on the Client Selector screen next to the client's ID number. Click the Note button to view the notes. When you click Save, Drake Accounting asks you to set up a chart of accounts, which you'll want to do if you plan on using the bookkeeping portion of Drake Accounting. For more information, visit accounting.drakesoftware.com.